Hey everyone, it's John Pollock here from The Law, live audio wrestling. And this past Sunday, Dan the Mouth Lebransky, Jason Agnew, and myself were joined by former WWE performer Harry D.H. Smith. The, the main thing is the big complaint that I have with WWE was just that they never gave me a, a fair chance, uh, ever, really. You know, I mean, we had a good deal with the, the tag team uh, title run and everything, but, you know, I mean, guys like Drew McIntyre and Sheamus, you know, they were, you know, obviously very good talents and big guys and everything, but, you know, if they had given me the, the rocket like they had given those two guys, I'm sure with my family's lineage and going over to Canada and the UK that they could have done some really good business, but... Uh, for whatever reason they didn't, uh, I'm not going to point any fingers at anybody, but I think that, you know, there's people up there that probably uh, didn't like my family or maybe my dad ripped too many of the guys that are <laughs> up top now uh, uh, there. So, um, you know, that's basically the way that it happened. And, I mean, I wouldn't want to, uh, I'm glad to be gone, really. I, I don't want to be wasting my time at a place that doesn't appreciate me or that doesn't want to do anything with me. You can catch that entire 25-minute interview with Harry Smith right now at LiveAudioWrestling.com in the podcast section where you can also download this past week's edition of Live Audio Wrestling. Looking ahead to this Sunday night, we're going to be joined by UFC welterweight champion George St. Pierre chatting about a number of different topics, including who his favorite professional wrestler was when he was growing up, and it might surprise you. In addition to that, we will be joined by Dave Meltzer of the Wrestling Observer Newsletter. We'll be recapping UFC 138 featuring Chris Levin and Mark Munoz and tons of wrestling chat on TSN Radio, 10.50 a.m. in Toronto, and you can listen worldwide at liveaudiowrestling.com.